What is going on fam? Skits here back with episode 101 from the one copper to one million gold series. Let's look at the mailbox, see what sold and what did not sell. 104,000 total gold, almost 300 messages yet to be uh, brought back into the mailbox. Thank you to everyone that has entered into the giveaway. I leave for Vegas tomorrow through the 13th. I will be back and that Monday before Tuesday reset is going to be when we draw for the 100,000 gold. Give everybody a chance to enter in. Um, if you're watching this and have not watched the previous episode, make sure you go back the 100th episode and type enter or entered any of that into um, the comment section and you're good to go. Again, we will draw on the live stream on Monday when I get back here and I am shooting for a minimum of a 12 hour stream so you guys will have plenty of time to enter on the YouTube, um, the last video, and then also um, on the live stream when we draw it, I'll give you guys full details leading up into that and uh, let you know what's going on. So it is almost 2 p.m. on the East Coast right now. The prices have rebounded heavily so let's go relist all of this. We have a bunch of inventory and then we'll go from there. I might reset the lay light shard market. It looked like it needed to be. So we'll see what's going on here. Also a blitterum coming back here. Some lay light shards seem to have fallen into the dirt, but there's not many of them. I might set these back up to about 40 gold per. We'll check chaos crystals and make sure those are not um, in the dirt as well. All right, here we go. A couple more reloads of the UI. 148 more messages yet to be shown. We'll put these up for probably 24 hours, all of these auctions. Since I'm going to be gone for a little bit, I don't want a 48-hour auction them. Um, we could. I guess it wouldn't hurt. We're going to do that just in case somebody wants to relist. Um or I don't know we'll see depending on what the item I'm thinking about the uh, the auction house cut and for the items that we're gonna list we'll uh, we might play it by ear some might be 12 some 24 some 48 all right here we go all these are going back up <clears throat> set it and forget it here for our trip And then we'll go from there. As Battle for Azeroth approaches, the auction house will pick back up. Um, but I hope to be done with this series well before that. It only takes a good week or a couple good weeks and we're good to go here. All right. Looks like we sold a whopping thousand. Not even. 800 gold, I think that was. So a majority of the things that we listed like I said after you leave them and we didn't even list our gems because of they were in the dirt so uh, this will be a good relist here I'm gonna show you guys what's going on it's prime time it's actually uh, 2 p.m. on the East Coast here and a thousand gold we have episodes like that not many but we didn't uh, we didn't list a majority of our hot items so here we go here back up to a thousand gold we're gonna put these up 15 stacks of one those are first the other gems will be second here. Masterful. These were, last episode, these were like 500 gold, 400 gold. We had to be patient. The gliders. Um, not my favorite. I'm going to put these up for 24 in stacks of 10. See if we can get um, any of these to expire. Not many up here. You never know. People uh, like pretty stacks. They might snag these. We'll leave those up there. All right. Lay light shards. Already been done. Holy moly. Perfect. Okay. Stacks of five going up first. I like it. 24 hours. These are going up at 43 gold I like it I like it I like it there was a lot more of these into the dirt at 20 uh, 
I might actually want to buy these up at 25. I'm going to think about it. I'm not sure how much they have. Um, Obliterum is in the dirt. This is asking to get reset, though. I'm going to do that. These are just simple stacks. Seven of eight is not my favorite, but um, these are really, really in the dirt. Like 340, 344 is dirt. We're going to grab these. We're going to relist these bad boys up. All right. And perfect. Those will go up right there. We're not going to put them right here. That's unrealistic. If Primal Obliterum, I don't even think is at 1,000 gold, but we're going to leave that there right now. Let's get our... Laylight, whoa, 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 holy moly. Our Laylight Shards back up. I don't know what price that was, that was insane. All right, those are going up. 431, nuts. That'd be great. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. We're also gonna get our Enchants up as well. 20 of our Enchant Priestess. We could spend a day liquidating all of this on the auction, I mean, in trade chat, um, and make a ridiculous amount of gold. But rules are rules. We're going to rock and roll with it. And we'll get our gold back up here. Let's see what we got here. These are still good. Our Masterfuls are still good. These are going to go up. 15 stacks of one. All right, our eggs got reset, it looks like. 14 stacks of 50. Those are going up. Let's sort the uh, bag real quick here. What's going on with our laystone ore? Not bad at all. Our 40 stacks of 10 going up right there. We're going to grab the rest of our Obliterum out of the mailbox. Do a couple quick checks here. What's going on with our versatility? Not terrible. All right, those are going up. 24-hour auctions around the board. All right, gems are good and gems are good. So... Realistically, if these were the cheapest for 15 minutes and nobody bought them, the next person can come undercut them and then that's a wrap for the day or for the episode to put all of this into perspective. So everybody geeking out, take a deep breath. That's what happens. I don't monitor these. I don't do anything else but list them, uh, look for deals, try to relay some things for you guys to snipe and um, hopefully you guys are making a lot of gold on your end and we're good to go. That's basically what happens. So let's grab the rest of these puppies. Twenty-five stacks of one, and then we'll put up some stacks of ten here as well. Kind of put everything up here. All right. Six stacks of ten, and the last two will go up in singles. Perfect. Priestess, good. Argulite, good. Deadly Deep, good. The first story time, the first week of Legion's Drop, I was realm first. The videos are on the YouTube channel. You can go back and see. I was selling gems for almost 8,000, 9,000 gold per and I couldn't keep them on the auction house. I literally was burning out of, and I can't wait for Battle for Azeroth because hopefully that's gonna be the same way. Um, because with anything, an influx of players, no matter who they are, they're gonna be buying and selling. They're gonna be buying and selling, and most importantly, um, they're going to be buying. And I think a majority of people spend time leveling to start the expansion or they spend time PvPing or whatever. I spend time, you know, leveling and questing, but I quickly go back 
and um, control the auction house and see what's new and what's not new. Let's clean up this uh, lean shank real quick here. Not too much. Put this back up at uh, right there. Get the rest of our eggs up here. All right. Got our lean shank up as well. Let's quadruple check. <clears throat> Masterful Argulite, good. Deadly Deeps, good. Enchant Priestess, great. Versatility, great. Chaos Crystals, what's going on with you guys? 111, 112. We're going to leave Chaos Crystals right now because we just did a lot with our Laylight Shards. Let's see if we can get rid of a couple of these, some stacks, and um, we'll better understand where the market is going with um, the Enchant Materials. All right, so our Argulite up, we're good. A couple more checks here. Some Fell Slate. 50 stacks of 200, oh my gosh. Imperium. Looks good, looks good, looks good, looks good, looks good. Primal Fires, 41, 42 stacks of one. Someone was farming, it's not, it's not a bad farm at all. Um, primal Water, all right. What about Primal Air? Usually the most expensive it is. All right, those look good. One more check through here. There you go, already. And I can't even afford that because someone else is gonna undercut that the whole way through. Um, 15 stacks of one going up. We're gonna let these marinate. Hopefully we get a window of an hour or two. Nine stacks of one going up. We're gonna leave those up right there. Might as well put these bad boys up with it. That looks good. And we're gonna leave the episode right there. Again, a 100,000 gold giveaway is going to be when I get back from Las Vegas. Twitch.tv slash itskits. If you are watching uh, this video right now, chances are I am live, so pop in. You guys can ask any gold-related questions you have. Um, vibe it up with the family as we prep. And um, we have open guild invites for our um, our guild on Kelthazad Alliance. For anybody interested, free repairs, all the heirloom gear, everything is taken care of for you. All you have to do is play, relax, enjoy the game, and vibe it up with the family. It is a mature guild, um, so just like our stream, um, good vibes, good vibes only. I love you guys. I will see you in the next episode. Again, twitch.tv slash itskits. I'm out of here. Peace.